effortlessly. There we go. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. I know, are you sick of my outfit yet? I'm kind of sick of my outfit so far. I'm, I'm just that lazy girl, I admit it. Yeah, I, I, I am. That is just not inspired enough at, um, let's see, 10 o'clock at night? 10, 10, 20, 10, 26 at night. 10, 10, 10, 26? 10, 26, yeah. Uh, that I am doing this to go change my clothes. So, it's called Real Life with a Real Time Job, my friends. Anyway, if you don't know, I, I ramble. Have you noticed I ramble? I ramble. BoxyCharm is a $21 a month, well, it was a $21 a month subscription, that comes with five full-size products, occasionally a little bonus thrown in there. It has now gone up to $25 a month. I locked in my $21 a month price by subscribing for a year, so I'm going to be getting this puppy for the next year. I'm very excited to hopefully get the Boxylux Premium, which they've been talking about for about a month now. They have not announced the release date. You could sign up for the notifications for when it was going to release. I'm hoping that it goes smoothly and that I'm able to get it because I would like to try it. So let me know if you guys are hoping to get it also. Yes, it's a lot of makeup products and you guys must saying, oh my goodness, with all this makeup. But honestly, it helps me get products for you guys for giveaways. And I love sharing my products with my family and people at work and stuff like that. So none of the product goes to waste. So, you know. Anyway, let's open her up. I don't do spoilers in case you're new here. I like to be surprised. The only thing I did do this month was you can now pick a product. And I picked the... I had two choices, and I wasn't thrilled about either of them, but I did want to pick, so I picked the Iconic London Spray. It's the only spoil that I remember picking. <laughs> Let me put on my glasses so we can see the theme. This is a nice, nicer pamphlet. They keep switching them up, which, you know, I really don't mind. So inside, they're going to tell me what the products are. Let me see. I have variation number 18. They have so many variations now, which I think is, it's good and it's it's bad. Do you know that means because maybe they have a very limited amount of the premium products that they're putting in, so the ones that they hype up, probably not a lot of people get, which can be a little sketchy in my opinion. Well, I'm never getting on a BoxyCharm PR list. <laughs> anyway, let's see what I did receive. So here is this big old bottle, which is really nice size. This is the Iconic London Prep Set and Glow. It's actually like really aesthetically pleasing to look at because it's squirrels. Very hypnotizing. I'm going to try this and let's see how it works. I love mists. I have an absurd amount of them, but I like them. Let's prime this first. Looks good. Use my kitty fan. Thank you, Pamela. a rose scent which doesn't overly thrill me um but i like it i think denatured alcohol can't read it too small gonna have to start getting out a big magnifying glass it leaves a really nice sheen on the face not glittery or sparkly like so you look like you're covered in glitter it just gives it a really nice sheen i like it Okay, so the next thing I have here is from Hank and Henry. I'm actually wearing a Hank and Henry highlighter that Pamela from Granny Skincare and Makeup After 65. I will link her below. She gifted this to me because she didn't use it. It's gorgeous. It's super soft and buttery. And I have his eyeliner that we got last month, which is in the Blickety Black. And, and now this is the mascara. It looks like it's dual-ended, doesn't it? I'm not going to open it. I have too many mascaras open. Slick With It Mascara Duo. Be very excited to read why it's duo. Unfortunately, I can't open it and show you. I'd be wasting too much product. All right, I'm happy. Okay, in here we have Hollywood and Vine. Never heard of them. This is just a black eyeliner. Honestly, this looks like an eyeliner. This sounds terrible but that I would get it like the dollar store. It feels very cheap. It's a black eyeliner. I mean, it's a big liner. Okay, it's actually quite creamy. I'll be 
excited to try this in my waterline. I didn't expect it to be creamy, so I'm not going to judge it yet. I just think the packaging feels very inexpensive. And I've never heard of Hollywood and Vine. So, let's see. That will last me, I think, forever. And what is this? This is from Mellow Cosmetics. This is the Tinted Brow Gel. I have several of these open as well. Hopefully it is in the proper color. I cannot read it. I am hoping that it is brown uh, because that's what my brows are. So we shall see. Ooh, and this is a dose of Colors eyeshadow palette. In their pop-up store, I ordered a dose of Colors. They had them on sale, and I didn't know I was going to get one in my box, but I think I paid 12 was it $12? I don't remember the price, but this is, I believe, a $35 eyeshadow palette. And I don't... Did I buy the Sassy Siennas? I don't remember. But also, I mistakenly bought two of them. I didn't know I was adding two to my cart. Yeah. No, I think I paid more than $12. The packaging is stunning. I haven't gotten them yet, obviously. The packaging is gorgeous. If I did indeed get three of the same... I'll either sell them on my Poshmark or put them into a giveaway. This is pretty. Uh, <laughs> Hello. It comes with a brush. Ooh, I don't like the brush, I don't think. This side's not bad, but this, uh, I don't know. I'll let you know about that. The colors are beautiful. Neutral, but wearable for me for an everyday look. I am going to swatch them. It feels soft. I do like the texture of um, the little imprints. It doesn't close properly. It keeps popping open, and everything is where it should be. No, it doesn't close properly. That's very disappointing. See how it keeps popping open? Listen. Now it's going to make a liar out of me. I'm not very happy with that, especially if this is a $35 palette. I think it should, you know, perform and close properly. They do swatch beautifully. I will do a look with this. Do I have enough to do a look? I'm going to have a decent amount, maybe. Not really. I don't have enough to do really do a full look, but if you want to see me use this palette, I would be very happy to do that because, you know, I have no problem uh, trying things on. Let's just read about this, shall we? In the back, they are telling you all the details about the, it says introducing BoxyCharm 2.0, the BoxyCharm Premium, which again is going to be $35, and they are telling you to sign up at BoxyCharm.com slash premium. I think that's just the alert because I really don't think that the box is available yet, but let's dive into this. So the Dose of Colors eyeshadow palette, yes, I was almost correct. I think it's 30, it is $32, but it says a five pan matte eyeshadow palette with a mixture of shades. This palette is a great way to add boldness and vibrance to your eye looks. I am going to be excited to try it. I said the, not, the palette not closing properly bothers me slightly. The Iconic London Prep Set and Glow, this is valued at $29. Again, I'm very happy to have this because I really won't go out and spend $29 on a face spray. That's just my own thing. But it says, Prep Set and Glow is a hydrating mist that refreshes with light reflecting properties that leave skin with an iconic glow. Haha, <laughs> funny. This stunning multi-use spray can be used to prep the skin before applying makeup, set a finished look, and add a radiant gloss to a bare face and body. Yeah, maybe. With extracts of cucumber and chamomile antioxidants, green teas, caffeine, vitamin E. It's 100% vegan, and it's help, going to help to condition the skin. Hopefully it does not have denatured alcohol. Okay, this one I got it. No. Okay, ready? Combat the look of dark circles. Really? This is not going to combat the look of dark circles. Sorry, guys. Hate to tell you. No. But... I am very happy that I have it and that I got it in a box that I only paid $21 for. This I'm curious to read about. I wish I didn't have so many mascaras open because when I get the new mascaras, I'm excited to try them. But I, again, I don't want to waste the four mascaras that I have open. It's very frustrating. I know, first world problems, right? The Hank and Henry Slick With It Mascara will have you feeling like you have major clout. <laughs> Who writes this stuff? 
This vegan mascara is not only really waterproof, I do like that very much, but it doesn't flake or transfer. I'll let you know. The Duo One applicator is designed to work with our formula for adding volume and length to your top lashes, while the other side is thin and designed to easily add mascara to your lower lashes. Okay. So I'm hoping it has a much smaller wand. I like that because I do use two separate mascaras. So that's a great concept. I like that. And it's $19. The Mellow Cosmetics Tinted Eyebrow Gel achieve effortlessly... Why can't I say that? Effortlessly... There we go. Tamed and tinted brows with Mellow's Tinted Brow Gel. A lightweight, non-sticky gel formula with a mini brush applicator allows you to finish and maintain a perfectly groomed eyebrow with no mess. And yeah, and they say it's worth $16. This is priced at about what I thought it would be priced at. The Hollywood and Vine Velvety Touch Smooth Coal Eyeliner. Line your eyes with the rich intensity of Velvety Touch Smooth Coal Eyeliner. The creamy formula goes on smooth and adds drama to any desired look. That's pretty simple explanation. It's valued at $7 that I said. I don't disagree with that. I think this constitutes right now a $7 price tag. If it's fabulous on the eyes, I, you know, won't have anything to say about it. Of course, they're saying that, you know, you can uh, win. I don't have time to do all these selfies and tag them all the time and everything like that. It's It, it gets tedious, if you know what I mean. So let's discuss the box. First, let's see what the value of the box is. Okay, 32 plus 29, so that is 50, uh, 61 plus 19, 61, 71 plus 9, that is 80, plus 16, that is 96, plus 7 will be 103. Hmm. Okay. That's probably one of the lower boxes that I've gotten, but again... It's still valued at way more than the price that I pay for it, so I'm not displeased with it. So let me know your thoughts. With 18 variations, I'd be very curious to see how many products were the ones that everyone got. What were the variations? Were there products that I said were the super premium ones that only a few people got? I'd like to know your thoughts and your theories regarding that. There's a lot of discussions to be had regarding a lot of these boxes because... Some people feel so strongly a certain way, other people feel so strongly the other way. And I always like to know what you feel and your way. So if you like this video, I would appreciate a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whichever you choose to do. And if you're new here, hello and thank you for watching the video. I appreciate it so much. And if you would like to subscribe, sis ooh, subscribe, that would mean a lot to me also. You may not want to now, now that you see I can't get words out of my mouth. But I want to thank you again so very much. You guys are the most amazing people I have ever almost not met. And I hope whatever part of this world you are in on around, you're having an amazing day and an amazing week. And I think that's all I'm going to do for tonight because I'm shot and I still have to edit another video. So, my friends, I love you and I will see you probably in a different outfit uh, in the next video. <laughs> much love, everybody. Bye.